Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I wanted to do a little video of me doing some spring cleaning as well as doing a little refreshing lunch because I have been pretty busy lately and I kind of wanted to share a little bit of what's been going on now that I'm a month away from graduating. I'm so excited but I've been extremely busy and I've been doing a lot of stuff so I kind of wanted to talk about like my mental health a little bit and what's been going on now that I'm almost graduating. It seems very weird to me that now I need to have have, like stuff prepared i'm at that point in my life where a lot of people are asking me like what are you gonna do after you graduate and a lot of the times i just stare blankly at their faces i really don't know what to say and you know i feel like you know someone's always supposed to have something prepared but i really don't like especially with my career i think a lot of this is gonna be just me continuing with my youtube and doing some freelance with you know acting jobs as well as some entrepreneurship little businesses that i'm looking into so there's just like a lot up in the air right now and it just feels a little bit overwhelming because i want to have a definitive answer for everybody but i just kind of look at them and i'm like i don't really know i really am just gonna focus on what I have in my life right now and all the freelance that I'm gonna focus on and hopefully with that I'm able to grow some sort of business or career out of it so we'll see what happens With all the things that are going on with school, I'm finishing a bunch of projects. I feel like in the midst of all of this, I'm like, okay, so I'm also supposed to have something else prepared like after I graduate, like it's kind of insane. I think a lot of these moments are big seasons of growth and I wanna be able to look back at these couple of months and just be like, wow, like look at me, like I was really doing all these things and I still had to have a plan. And I mean, little do I know, like maybe a month from now things will happen and I just didn't expect it or things that I thought weren't going to turn out well but they did and so I just kind of want to keep one foot forward and just focus on all of my choices are going to be something that's going to turn fruitful over time so yeah just being able to be like hey you know I'm 23 I still have most of my life ahead of me and we'll see where this career leads me I can always pursue things later other things that I'm interested in so I have a lot of faith I have a lot of hope but it does feel very scary when you're at the edge of the cliff and you're about to jump and you have your parachute and you're like, I have to jump. I have to take that big leap of faith. I've really been mostly excited because I know that now with the things that I want to pursue, I'm able to define my own schedule and have the ability to do everything that I want. But now I can have more time to devote to those endeavors rather than having school tying me down on most of my days. Because I come back from school and if I have homework, I have to do that. And once I have all that free time, I'm able to create a schedule for myself and be a lot more intentional with the things that I want to do. So I am extremely excited for these new endeavors and i think this is a perfect segue for this next part of this video that i wanted to talk about which is where this channel is changing again so i've done a lot of things with this channel i've tried posting reels i've tried changing it up i've tried only doing long form videos i've tried mixing long form videos with short form videos i tried to post more short form videos and like once a month i would post like long form videos and i think that right now i am looking at other aspects of how to release content on this channel and i'm still thinking about what exactly i want to do but it's definitely something that i want to be able to shift my schedule towards right after I graduate because now that I will have more time for social media I think that I'm able to embark on new ways to change this channel up because I want to keep myself creatively involved I want to be able to grow creatively as well and artistically so I think that this new change is gonna be a big help so just keep an eye on that I don't really know exactly how I'm gonna plan everything but it will definitely be changing and I will definitely let you guys know when that happens but currently right now there can't be a lot of planning because a lot of my planning is towards like senior projects and a lot of graduation you know details but I know that in May uh, once I graduate I'll be able to spend a little bit more time on that and hopefully I'll be able to show you guys a little bit of that happening in the summertime so definitely stay tuned for that 
but otherwise I'm extremely excited because now I get to be a lot more creatively involved in a lot of aspects of my life and I think because YouTube is my biggest inspiration artistically and creatively I'm able to use YouTube as like my first thing that I want to change and hopefully with this I'm able to pour into other aspects of my life artistically and I'm a big girl now. I've uh, almost graduating. I am able to do whatever I want with my career, which is insane. But changing topics, I've lately been learning a lot of songs in the piano because it's one of those things where like I stopped playing the piano for like two weeks and then I remembered why I loved playing it and so I learn a new song and then I leave it and then I learn something else and it's just like a really big stress reliever for me so once i'm able to learn a song i'm just able to like go back into it and continue learning it and it just feels like i'm doing a little something aside whenever i'm able to create that muscle memory and learn a new song and when i sit back down i just like know it a lot better i just feel super motivated to continue learning and it's just like another creative aspect of my life that i love and so that's what I've been doing lately. I've also been thinking of a lot of ideas for reels and doing a lot of things in that aspect, but it's spring. I love that now it's no longer nighttime at 7 p.m. So we have a whole new hour of daytime. I'm extremely happy about that. And it feels like my days are longer. It feels like I'm a little bit more productive. It kind of came at a perfect time because since I'm doing a lot of things, I feel like I have more time in the day. It like makes me a little bit more rejuvenated. It's March, it's the beginning of spring. So it just feels really, like fresh and new and everything just feels very fresh and new in my life. I'm kind of in this weird limbo where I'm in between phases which is like kind of a hidden gem I feel like. I feel like a lot of people want to get to the other side very quickly because it's a little bit uncomfortable and like yeah I'm not gonna lie it is a little bit uncomfortable because you're uncertain of the future you don't really know what's gonna happen you're kind of scared of leaving like your past life because how do you know that this new life will be able to not affect you or like help you at all so it's definitely still a little bit scary and it's like jumping off that cliff again but there's a lot of beauty in these moments right now you know just cleaning my kitchen making my lunch and just thinking about like okay well I know that in a couple of months my life is gonna look a little different but so much can change in a year and it doesn't have to be super drastic I can go in my own pace but just being really patient with myself and just understanding that I'm not a superwoman I can't change in an instant I know that my time management is gonna suck some days and my organization is just not gonna be on point some days I'm just gonna be lazy like I understand but just having that grace and that patience with yourself where you don't like wallow in your current state of mind and just being able to be like it's fine we continue on because in the journey is where you grow so in these moments right now and in the in between a lot of people don't like it so i'm just in that moment where i'm like okay i just have to trust and right now it's perfect if i continue on to this path and have this like positive outlook so i'm just like extremely blessed and grateful that i'm able to put myself in that mental position and and I can honestly say I haven't really been struggling with being scared to graduate. I've just been definitely a little intimidated, but I still mostly feel excitement. I still mostly feel like I'm ready for the future. So I'm just taking it day by day. And I know that when fall comes around and I'm starting on these new endeavors, I won't regret it. All you have to do is look back at yourself a year ago from now, and you're going to see a very different person. And especially now when we're very young, when all of us are like you know in our 20s 30s like a lot of us change in this time of our lives i mean my brain isn't even fully developed so that just really goes to show like how far we still have to come and so many things that are still going to change in our lives I think that we have to give ourselves a lot of grace in that because I know that because we restrain ourselves, we're not able to give ourselves growth in fear of being hurt in the process or being proved wrong. But those are the moments where you have to combat and say, no, if this is making me a better person for people in this world and for myself, then it's definitely worth it because the moment that we do that, 
yeah, we have to put our pride and our ego aside, but we have to be able to say like, listen, I know that this is going to be rough. I know that I'm going to have to face a lot of demons, but I'm going to have to face that because if I don't, then what's the point of staying stagnant? If anything, you're just going to go downhill. It's just going to make you a lot more anxious. It's just going to make you a lot more panicky and it's just not really worth it. Like that other side of pain, of resentment is going to be a lot worse than whatever growing pains you had to go through going the other way to a better self so just looking at that from like a bird's eye view like i know it's gonna be painful i know it's gonna be hard but these are the moments that really matter and i think that mindset of being like i mean at least for me i'm a very practical person so if i see something that i'm like mm, like technically if i do it this way it's actually the lazy way because i'm putting more hard work if i like resent everything and i just don't want to grow because i'm scared of the future like i just have to be like no this has to be this way and i know it's gonna be hard but it's even harder the other way so if i want to make it easier for myself i'm just gonna have to go through the growing pains so it's a great thing to do and if it doesn't work like you can just move on and do something else like at least for me i'm like i'm gonna pursue this youtube thing i'm gonna pursue this acting thing i'm young if it doesn't work it doesn't work and i move on and it's fine just being able to reflect and be like okay it's fine don't worry about it and just moving forward i feel like this whole Whole video is about moving forward and about graduating college it's really what it's been going on in my life lately so i just really wanted to share that it's really been in my heart anyways this became a little bit of a self-help video which i was not intending it was just a little life update video with a little aesthetic cleaning and cooking but i hope that this was somewhat motivating for you guys it was extremely rejuvenating for me and exciting because i love documenting it and kind of just like putting like a little vlog journal bookmark into my life but i really hope you guys enjoyed this video please like this video because that's how you let me know subscribe for more videos like these and hit the little bell notification right next to the subscribe button so that you get notified every single time that I post and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!